just a normal workday downtown for office workers. Or is it? First, you notice the ears, maybe a tail. I think that's what they love to do. It's fun for them. It's fun for us because we work right here and we're stressed. <laughs> and when we're done being stressed, we come out and see Absolutely. them. It, so it's it, fun. It puts a smile on your face? It does. It's very exciting. The furries, or fur suitors, just one part of Anthrocon, the convention that has called Pittsburgh home for 11 years. It's a celebration of cartoons. And it's a really great time of the year to have them because it's very hard for us to book conventions on July 4th weekend because it's traditionally a family time. And they have come here for the 11th year in a row and really have been embraced within Pittsburgh. If you want to see the big fursuit parade, it's Saturday at 2 o'clock. Part of 10th Street will be shut down for the thousands of dragons and bears and, well, whatevers. It gives people of Pittsburgh a chance to interact with our characters and our first suitors, let them see the performance skills. It's a way for us to give back something to the city that's really embraced us and given us a lot of love. Besides the furries, there's music. Billy Joel will fill PNC Park Friday night, and the boats on the river have already found a spot ahead of the Kenny Chesney concert Saturday night. Visit Pittsburgh is not worried about trash. What happened a few years ago was very much an isolated case. Pittsburgh is very good at handling these big events, and we know what to do before, during, and after, so I don't see this as being a problem. Obviously, we want everybody to respect the city and respect the people that live in and are visiting. Wait, there was one more thing. Oh yeah, fireworks. Pittsburgh will host its famous display Monday at 935, which will fill Point State Park. So, of course, all these things bring a lot of money mm -hmm. into the city, right? The Anthrocon convention has brought $6.3 million in one weekend alone in the wow. past. And Kenny Chesney also has brought in $8 million with his past shows. Yeah, so there's some trash, but it brings some money to the economy, so too. So furries, fireworks, Billy Joel, a.k.a. Kenny Chesney. Chesney. Is that all you've got? There's more. There's, there's more? more? Absolutely. Okay. Big weekend in Pittsburgh. Don't say there's nothing to do around here. <laughs>